I'm Anil Kumar sharing with you one of the most popular question on permutation and combination. Another important thing here is that most of the time we get wrong solution for this particular question. In this video, I will not only discuss with you the correct solution, but I'll also talk about how we end up getting wrong solution. The question here is, the number of arrangements of letters of the word daughter in which the vowels do not occur together are four choices are given to you. Now let's look into this. We know the vowels are A, E, I, O, U, so A, U, and then we have E. So this letter, this word has three letters which are vowels, right? So we could write this as D. So A is a vowel, right? U is a vowel. Then we have G, H, T, E is a vowel, and R. The question is that these vowels A, U, E should not be together. Okay, that is the question. Now let me discuss with you how we end up getting wrong answers. Some of the students will say, well, there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and so the answer is eight factorial, or which is four, zero, three, two, zero. Well, definitely not. These are definitely the total number of ways in which you can arrange these eight letters. Some of us, what we do is that we kind of combine these three and then say well total is 8 factorial but what we should do is that we should combine them all and find total number of ways and then subtract from 8 factorial well they say well now we have 1 2 3 4 5 and 1 there 6 factorial right so we have this as 6 factorial I mean okay 6 factorial times these are three different letters so times 3 factorial and we can take away from 8 factorial to get our answer. So that will ensure that all three of them are not together. But well, two of them could be together. So this is wrong and this is also wrong because in this case, two could be together. So what is the right solution? That is what we are going to look into now, right? So now let's look into correct solution. You can also pause the video, answer the question, and then look into my suggestions. So now let's talk about the correct solution. So what we are given here is the word daughter, which has D, a, you know, is not a vowel, so we'll keep it separate, but we can have G, H, T, and R. I mean, sorry, R, right. Now, what we will do here is that we'll arrange the letters which are not vowels, which are 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5, right? Three of them, which are vowels, which are A, U, and E, we can insert in between, ensuring that they are always separate. You get my idea. So that is how we actually find the solution. So the solution for this question is, number of ways in which one, two, three, four, five letters can be arranged, so their arrangements, will be 5 factorial, correct? And now we'll look for inserting A, U, E in the spaces in between. You get an idea. So if I insert A, let us say here, U there and E somewhere there, they are ensured to be separate. None of them will be together. You get an idea. 
Now, how many ways are there to insert three letters in one? So we have one, two, three, four, five, six in six spaces. So that is 6P3. Correct? Therefore, the total number should be how much? So the correct solution here is product of these two, right? So in all these arrangements, we could insert AUE in the spaces in between. So it is 5 factorial times 6P3. That is the correct solution. So let's figure out how much it is. So we have 5 factorial times 6P3 and that is equal to 14400. So these are the total number of ways which is option C. Now some of you could actually take 6C3 so you'll get option D which will again be wrong. You get my idea. So those are the three popular wrong answers for this question. I want you to be very much aware of this. And that's the whole idea of taking this particular word, daughter. So the number of ways to ensure that the vowels are not together or they are separated is 14400 as shown here in this video. I hope that helps. Feel free to share my videos with your friends so that they understand how to solve such a question. And also watch some of the related videos for which I am providing you a link. Thank you and all the best.